we will compare C and Rust on parameters like code execution time, job market, community size, popularity, and few more. So let's start with code execution time. I just ran a simple test for finding execution speed, and for that I have created a simple function which will count to 1 billion, and we will count the time taken by both the languages for completing the loop. By this we can compare the difference of execution time, and I have compiled this same function for five times for accurate results, and every time it gives that C is faster. Yes, Rust is not as fast as C, but it is fast if we compare it with other languages. But raw speed isn't everything in modern programming. Memory safety plays a big role, and when it comes to memory safety, Rust is much better than C language. And that's the one of reasons why AWS, Dropbox, Microsoft, Apple, and other big companies started using Rust. But don't just take my word for it. The data of Stack Overflow developers survey shows something fascinating. If we show the list of popular tech in Developer Survey 2020, it shows that Rust was standing at 5.1%, while C language was at 21.8%. But if we compare this with the survey of 2024, it says Rust is at 12.6%, while popularity of C language has gone down to 20.3% instead of increasing. Now you are probably thinking why this increase in Rust popularity? The simple answer is that Rust is just inherently safer because of a lot of protection mechanisms. You can make use of unique PTR and shared PTR and so on to get the same kind of safety in C language that Rust has. But with Rust, it's the default behavior. And the fact is that it's inbuilt in the language, which also means that mistakes don't create runtime errors. They create compile errors. This means mistakes in Rust are like forgetting your car keys while going out. So you will realize this when you reach the car, meaning the compiler catches the mistake. But mistakes in C language are like you forgot to put gas in the car, and now you are stuck in the middle of nowhere, meaning you will get production failures. After this much security, does Rust give developers job security as compared to C language? The answer is complicated, but in favor of Rust. Because as we move forward, more and more companies are switching towards Rust, so there will be job openings for this. But if we compare it to C language, C is everywhere. It's used in space rockets, cars, ships, hardware. So C already being used in so many places requires many developer jobs to, to manage this. So C is still a good career option, but Rust will create new opportunities in the future. So the final question is, is Rust a replacement for C language? Unfortunately, it probably won't, won't be a replacement for C because of two reasons. C has a lot of code out there and a lot of prior knowledge, experience, and default choices in the industry, perhaps more than any other language. That's a mighty rolling boulder of force that we're trying to hold back with a feather. So in my opinion, Rust is still young and doesn't really have quite the same strong standard libraries and community which C language has yet. And the question isn't if Rust will thrive, but how big it will become. In conclusion, both languages have their own pros, so you should try something before you say it's bad or good. Also, do you know butterflies have taste receptors on their feet that help them find food? This sentence is not at all related to the topic, but I feel like saying it. That's all. Thank you for your time.